Jean, they're ready. At the 1200, A course, it's good, they're off. Winning Brew and Regency Bobo both missed the start. Trust Me was away well. Take What You Need goes forward and Noir Riders out very wide with Hello Beauty punching up. Ming Warrior, Sunset Watch next from Shadow Run of four wide. Next is Soulmate and a length to Transcendent Super Dobbins on the rail. Master Montaro's drifted back early around Winning Brew Smart Folks and Regency Bobo's a length away last. It is Noir Rider leading 700 to go. Hello Beauty second and three wide is Shadow Runner. Fourth, the inside is the late back, trust me. Next, take what you may need and three wide with cover, Sunset Watch. They were followed by Soulmate, Ming Warrior, then Transcendent, Master Montaro. He has six links to make up and is hard ridden. It is Noir Rider, the leader, with 300 metres to go. A length on Hello Beauty, trust me. Out wide, Master Montaro and Transcendent start to come down the centre. Master Montaro, he's come from near enough to last to join in. Trust me, Super Dobbin driving through the middle. Master Montaro still in front. Zach picks up where he left off on Wednesday night. Master Montaro won it. Beat Super Dobbin. Third of photo between Trust Me and Regency Bobo. Then take what you need. Hello Beauty and Transcendent. Sunset Watch and Soulmate. Next in is Winning Brew. Noir Rider gave a massive sight for a long wait. Better than 100 to 1 from Smart Folk, Shadow Runner and Ming Warrior is the last one in. Master Montaro. Zach Purton and David Hayes win the first on International Day from Super Dobbin. Chad Schofield and trust me, Matthew Chadwick a return to the saddle. And he's run third, six, three, and 13 it will be. He had a lot of ground to make up, Master Montaro. That's been an awesome win. Super Dobbin hit a late gap through the middle. But Master Montaro, he's unbeaten. Won two in Australia, one here, so he, he doesn't know what it's like to be rolled. He went off at 2.2 with some late money coming for Super Dobbin. And trust me, running third. So the three best-backed runners in race one have run one, two, three. We're still waiting on third. It's 108.97, the winner's time. So they're inside standard. David Hayes has a perfect start to the day. And the long jean IJ first start is any possible uh, run ons as well, Tom. Let's have a look at uh, the patrol here. And uh, he jumped out uh, of uh, his wide stall of gate 10, Master Montari. You can see that Regency Bobo was uh, slow away. In the early push, you've got Trust Me there with Take What You Need and Out Wider, Hello Beauty. Noir Rider coming across for uh, Tom Marquand out wider on the track, followed by Shadow Runner. Uh, then you've got Transcendent caught a little bit wide around Sunset. Watch Super Dobbin there and the eventual winner, Jenny. He's got three behind him, Master Montari. They were winning brew, smart folk. Oaks and Regency Bobo. Yeah, and it just took a little while to settle uh, the winner, Master Montaro, but uh, then he did settle really quite nicely there and very comfortable in that position back um, off midfield. Uh, the horse that runs fourth, Regency Bobo, who's always been a, a pretty consistent type of horse, was taken back from that uh, wide gate there, but he really does finish off very strongly here. Transcendent, another pretty plain Jane sort of performance from him, but um, I like the way this winner gets home. He does, I think he wants to lay in a little bit in the straight. We'll watch this on the head on. Um, but uh, no harm done. You can see Transcendent wanting to uh, run out there as well. Hello Beauty under pressure. Trust me, he's got a slashing race. You've got Super Dobber. Now he just starts to land a little bit to here. Uh, Master Montari, but he's uh, picked them up from a long way back. Regency Bobo steaming home down the outside. Noir Rider 